I think that uh, it's very, very important. And I've always uh, believed that from when I started having assets, that I do age appropriate uh, uh, investments. My first investment was into a, a, a government bond called US 64, which after three weeks of my investment, the money went down the drain because the government uh, put a lockdown on it. And uh, I eventually got my money after much later. That kind of took away my faith in uh, in uh, uh, how I should invest in terms of what looks most obvious. My parents who have been investing in US 64 for a long time, they thought it's a UTI best way to save for my future, but it turned out to be a disaster as far as I was concerned. For other people, it must have worked. So my investments, uh, I do have advisors. I listen to a lot of people. But um, I have realized that for me, uh, you know, uh, investing in highly risky situations is not a, is not something that I'm comfortable with. So, uh, and also uh, age appropriate. So I want to make sure that I enjoy my wealth while I can. Uh, you know, I'm able to provide the best education for my son. I'm able to enjoy a good car or a good lifestyle while I can. Because no point in me making 25 crores when I'm uh, 65 years old, when I can't spend that money. It doesn't make sense. You know, as you grow older, you become minimalistic in your approach. You know, you want a smaller house. You want lesser people to be roaming around the place. You want lesser assets. You want to have things under control so that you can enjoy the finer aspects of life. So um, mostly uh, real estate uh, for me uh, with whatever little money that I managed to save. And, uh, you know, that, that has proven to be more of, over a long period of time has been a, um, a fairly uh, successful investment. And apart from that, I don't have many advisors because every advisor comes in with a point of view that makes him, uh, you know, think that he understands what I want. So by the time I explain to them that this is what I want to do, most people have come back with a, uh, you know, with a, with a uh, answer that, you know, it's best that you just <laughs> pay your taxes, uh, which you are always doing on time. Uh, save that man, you know, that money. And if you're comfortable investing in real estate, do that. Uh, because I don't have the ability to, or I don't have the uh, bad habit of living beyond my means. So I don't spend more money than I earn. And I don't have, uh, you know, the idea of either showing off my wealth. So when these three uh, things have been kept away, then I am uh, I feel extremely comfortable uh, with the kind of investments I've made right now. Uh, and of course, advising, uh, advisory uh, help is extremely important because in today's world, the cryptocurrency is creeping in. Uh, you know, the blockchains and the metaverse is going to be a, a completely different financial structuring and uh, philosophy. And one has to stay ahead of uh, the curve to understand that and make the right investments. So that's where I am uh, in my life financially. Mm -hmm.